hey guys what's up welcome back to my channel thank you so much for clicking on today's video today I am sharing with you what I got for my birthday as you guys know or maybe you don't um, I recently just turned 30 June 2nd and I would have done this video a lot earlier but I was waiting for a couple things to come in the mail so that is why I'm just now getting to it um, and you might be thinking girl why are you in your car showing us what you got for your birthday well Derek is sick and he's hawking and yakking up like the thought of it it's just so gross and I'm sure you guys don't want to hear that nonsense in the background so so yeah I just thought I would show you guys in the car so I'm gonna quit rambling and without further ado let's get started So my mom is like the cutest thing ever and I think these kinds of gifts are the best gifts in my opinion she got me like a basket from I'm assuming TJ Maxx and put some stuff in it and then I got some other stuff when we went down to Puyallup. I picked some stuff out and then I'll just explain who it's from like as we go. So this wasn't included in the basket, but this is from Derek's parents and his mom is an airborne consultant and so she gives me their products. They're actually very good. Um, so she gave me this micellar water and you don't wash it off so you put it on and it sleep with it on and then you can take off in the morning and then she also threw in their mascara it's called it's a long story mascara which is pretty cute actually this mascara is actually incredible she also gave me this beautiful eyeshadow palette as you guys know I love my neutrals I'm actually wearing this today. There's the true color right there. Um, these are pretty. I love this palette. The formula is really good, and that's the front of the packaging. Um, really pretty. like the formula. Um, so, yeah, and then she gave me money and a gift card. Um, the gift card might be in here somewhere because I haven't spent it yet. Okay, now I'm going to get into the stuff that my mom got me that was in the basket. Okay, so first thing I'm gonna pull out is this Hemp's lotion you guys my dad would highly recommend he is obsessed with this stuff and this is the scent raspberry cream blushing grapefruit and raspberry cream it smells so good and this lotion is amazing whether you are a fan of hemp or not like this stuff is amazing so I love that I love that she got me that and then she she's so cute threw in like little snacks in here pistachio berry mix just very cute stuff she got me and then she got um this gingham by bath and body works body wash i love the packaging it smells incredible i've already smelled it but yeah i don't even know very fresh very clean very summer spring and again love the packaging I'm a candle girl. I think we all know that. This, I freaking love this packaging. So cute. And it's from Bath and Body Works. So I love that it says Seattle on it. And it's Seattle White Caramel Cold Brew. You guys. OMG. Like, burning this in the house. I'm going to smell like the best freaking espresso shop ever next thing she got me was this adorable ray dunn bowl that says good morning it's a really good size um i love this so glad i'm finally getting this video done because now i can use it and put my yogurt parfaits in there and all that kind of stuff next thing she got me which hmm shouldn't have but i'm actually low-key really excited so she got me this pb crave cookie dough spread oh my god it looks amazing so good so that was in there as well and then these baked chocolate chip bars protein bars simply i've never tried these before but i mean who doesn't like nuts granola milk chocolate and you know a little bit of protein they say clean chewy and satisfying so excited about that oh 
oops. Then there was another candle, Aloha Kiwi Passion Fruit. Um, this is their White Barn line at Bath and Body Works. Love the packaging of this one too. And you guys, this smells freaking insane. Go smell this. This smells so freaking good. She got me a home goods gift card this mug is so stinking cute i like i said i'm glad i'm getting this film because i've been wanting to use this so she got me this coffee mug because i am obsessed with coffee mugs and it says girl boss on it and look at how fancy she is and then on the inside I love when mugs have stuff written on the inside. It says, just a girl with goals. And it's a pretty good mug. Great handle. And yeah, these were in here as well. These milk chocolate pretzels. And then she got me these Ray, Ray Dunn pen set. And they say, faith, hope, and love. I'm excited to start using these. She got me a card fun fact you guys i keep every single card i get i'm pretty sure like i have every card i've ever gotten since i was five i think i even have one from when i was three years old um but yeah i keep every card i get i it's just what i do and then she also got me this ray dunn tasks like to-do list i love that it's not magnetic but that's okay um love that and then the last thing that was in the basket were these gummy bears now you guys as you can see i already opened this bad boy now let me just explain something to you really quickly okay like i am not a gummy bear person i love a sour patch kids or like gummy worms or something like that but gummy bears no but let me tell you if you guys see these out and about, I've seen them at TJ Maxx and places like that. I'm not sure where else you can get them. Maybe Walmart or Target or something. These are the best gummy bears I have ever tried in my entire life. Gummy period. You can tell when you feel the package that these are are gonna be bomb like they feel so good they're fat free gluten free low sodium i mean it's a gummy bear you can't really get healthy with gummy bears right um but listen to the flavors cherry strawberry mango pineapple lemon orange green apple watermelon pink grapefruit lime blue raspberry grape these are so freaking amazing i'm surprised they're not gone already but if you guys see these i 100 percent recommend these pick them up you're gonna hate me but i'm telling you what you want your kids to do something hand them one of these and they'll kiss your feet you know what i'm saying they're so freaking good they're so good so that's the last thing that was in the basket but me and my mom like i said went down to Puyallup and we went shopping and she let me pick out some stuff which was really nice of her my mom's the best um so um, we went to Ulta and Sephora and I picked up, you guys know I've talked about this before and rave about it, the Peach Perfect setting powder. Now, I already started using it. I just couldn't wait, um, but I just put it back in the packaging for you guys. I love the packaging. So freaking cute, especially for, it doesn't matter. The product, this is one of the best setting powders I've ever tried, but if you guys are not wanting to spend the money of what this costs. They do have a mini or a dupe that I think is actually very comparable is the Makeup Revolution um, banana powder that they have. Um, so yeah, but I highly recommend this if you can afford it or wanna pay the money on it, splurge a little. It's so good, you guys, and it lasts a long time. The smell is incredible. It's so good. It's a little strong, but like it, Ugh, it's so good and then what else was that it oh and then i see this right here my grandma they don't live by me but they sent me a card they sent me some money and she gave me a starbucks gift card which i have not used yet now me and my mom like i said um, i feel like a broken record but we went shopping oh this is actually i bought these myself the day before my birthday and and i'm obsessed you guys i got these from walmart okay I already wore one pair 
um, actually two pairs and I put one back on, but I didn't put these back in the package, but look how cute. Oh, it's gonna focus on my face. But look how cute these earrings are, okay? They're like kind of like a drop situation. I have pictures on my Instagram and they came in a set for $4.88, okay? So stinking cute. I was obsessed. I snagged these real quick and yeah, I love them, okay? Me and my mom went to Victoria's Secret and I picked out some underwear. I will show you guys um, what I got. I haven't, I've been waiting to wear these two. Um, I just have been waiting to show you. So I got this print, which is really cute. Just a cute leopard. I love the style of these, um, like with the lace on top. I love the fit of these. So I got those. And then these are really cute. They've got like a ruching on the butt and they're like a gray stripe in the front. So those, and they were seven, I think, no, five for 25 or something. Then I got these um, like little pink ones. I love the material, this is really different. So I got those and then I love the fit of these ones. They've got the little brand on top and they're just regular black panties. And another black pair with the Victoria's Secret. And yeah. Now I know there's controversy around Victoria's Secret and how they don't support plus size um, people. And uh, you know, it is what it is, but that's pretty much the only place I buy my underwear and yeah, so I got that cute little bag. I love the bag. I always keep little bags like this. And then we went to H&M, and you guys, they had such cute stuff, okay? So, the first thing, I freaking love these. These shorts I got, the button up, okay? They have rips in the pockets. They're so cute. I did have to size up because there's no stretch to them, and because they button all the way up like there's no give. So um, they look like they'd be short. Whoops, that's my uh, garage door opener. They look like they'd be pretty like short shorts, but they're not, they're not. Um, so love these. And these were, if you guys are curious, they were $24.99. So freaking cute though. And let me show you. Ah what else I got from H&M. Oh, and then at um, Sephora, I got my birthday gift, and it was Drunk Elephant. So shocked by that. I said, yes, I want that, okay? And then, so, I don't know if you guys follow me on Instagram, but I did a story how I rushed up back to H&M because I had to exchange some shirts because their shirts, they looked big on the hanger, but when I put them on, like I couldn't tie them in the front and that's ideally what I wanted to do with these. And when I went there to exchange one of the shirts that I love so much, and I'll show you on my Instagram what that one looked like um, because I was so upset that they didn't have it in my size and um, and yeah. So, I hope you can see. So you see that leopard print? It was so freaking cute. Like the print was just perfection. I don't know why I didn't put that one in front, but that's okay. And they didn't have it in my size and I didn't want to wait, but I found something else. So, I got this shirt and the prices were so good. This these were 4.99, you guys, okay? And it's like a little polka dot. It's not a white, but it's a cream. So I got this shirt for $4.99, love that. And then I got this shirt, this plain white shirt, but it says, ah, beautiful soul on it. I love it. I also have a shirt from them already and it says glow, girl glow. I also have that on my Instagram if you guys want to see what that looks like. This one was $12.99 but the fabric on these are incredible and if you do end up picking this up, be careful. Don't dry it. It'll shrink on you um, a little bit. Um, so, and instead of the cheetah print, I exchanged it for this shirt and um, it wasn't $4.99, it was $9.99, but I 
I fell in love the second I saw this, you guys. It's a shirt, a white shirt, obviously. But look at this detail. See that beading? It's a bumblebee and it says, sweet like honey. So effing cute, right? Oh no, I just realized I forgot. So I also got a white little cardigan as well um, from there, but I left it at home. Um, yeah, so I love that shirt. This shirt, did I say the price? Yeah, this shirt was surprisingly $9.99. I was so shocked by that. But I cannot wait to wear this, you guys. I will put my Instagram handle there and take pictures when I do. So freaking cute. I can't even deal. Okay. So that is what I got. Then, this is what I was waiting for in the mail. Oops, let me grab my keys to cut it open. Um, I wanted this at Sephora, but they didn't have it in stock, but they said that they would order it for me and send it to my house free of charge. What is this? Oh, I guess that's just to not have it rattle around. We'll put it in a smaller box, how about? So, I'm so excited to use this. The Cover FX Bronzer and Highlight Duo in Sunkissed Bronze. It's beautiful, you guys. And the packaging is so nostalgic. It reminds me of something my mom would have had in her makeup collection back in the day. It's stunning. Beautiful, right? I'm so excited to use this. I've heard such good things about this. So yeah, my mom also got me that. And then my camera just stopped recording, so I hope it doesn't look weird. But anyways, and then I got a um, Old Navy gift card and I already spent some of it, so I thought I would show you guys what I picked up. Aren't these shorts adorable? Look at that mustard. I have a cardigan kind of like this color and I love these. I got a size large because I wanted them a little bit baggy, not tight. So I love these little jawstring, cute pockets. Got that. So cute. Those were on sale. And then also this cardigan, I have the gray one and I'm obsessed with it. But I got a cream color and I thought these two went together so well or with ripped denim. But this cardigan, you guys, it's got the little slits and that kind of detail on it. I love the cardigan. They have it in a pretty um, purple color too that I tried on in my Old Navy try on haul. Um, yeah, and this one was on sale. They're on clearance right now. Not majorly discounted, but they are discounted. So, I got that, and it was the last one left, so I picked that up. And I still have a little bit left to spend on my gift card, but I'm not in a hurry. Oh, okay, so, another reason why I'm doing this in my car is because... So I got this wallet after Derek and I went to eat for my birthday from TJ Maxx that day and loved it, fell in love. I thought it was a really good price. It was $9.99, but the issue with this wallet is once I got my cards and stuff in here, the way the button sits, it wouldn't let me snap it. So I was like, I was gonna put up with it because I really liked it, but I'm like, no, I want my wallet to shut, so I'm gonna return that. Um, so that is it, you guys. That is what I got for my birthday. I'm so grateful for everything that I got, and I am waiting for something in the mail. I'm not sure what it is. It's from Derek's sisters, and they mailed it to me because they weren't. I wasn't able to see them on my birthday. So, I um, mean, yeah, I am waiting for that stuff, but I really wanted to get this video up for you guys. I'm extremely grateful for everything that I got. It's really sweet. Um, I was just kind of in a funk and I don't want anything for my birthday, you know what I mean? Um, but my mom really made it a special day, hung out with my dad um, a couple days prior, had a movie date, it was a lot of fun and spent a lot of quality time with Derek and stuff and he given me money to go buy what I want and I haven't bought it yet, so, bought anything yet. So, 
um thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a big thumbs up also if you're new to my channel please consider subscribing before you leave and i guess i will see you guys in my next one bye